Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ariel Ray. It's good to have you. So if you're new here, I have a baby and he tends to make an appearance every video, if not. Um, I'm lucky if I can get one in without him in there, but most of the time he's in. So he's actually taking a nap behind me. I finally got him down. He's very, very tired. He's ready for a nap. So let's see, hopefully I'll be able to get through this video as fast as I can. Mind you, this is the second time I'm recording this same video because um, I ran out of memory on my card, so I had to restart again. Okay, so if you don't know what BoxyCharm is, BoxyCharm is a beauty subscription. It's a monthly subscription. So they have a $25 tier, which is five products for $25 or full size. Excuse me, you have a premium box, which is $35, and that one you get six to seven, but it's always six that I've noticed that I see. Um, and then you have your Lux box, which happens quarterly. So every three months you can choose to receive a boxy Lux. So that one is $50. So if you get the base box, they tack on another $24. Yeah, because it's 27. Your regular base box it comes out to about 27 with taxes. Um, and you're able to receive the base, the Lux box. So during the Lux months, so this month is March, so it's a Lux month, you will not receive your base box. You can either opt to have your premium and your Lux, your Lux together, so that'll be $50 plus 35 for your premium. You can do it that way, or you can add another account where you can add your base box to that one and then keep your boxy lux on your original account and if you want to get your premium or however you decide you can also get your premium on that one or if you want to decide to get two luxes you'd have one lux on one account and then another lux on another account so anyways this month is very very late so we are the 29th of march today i'm trying to push this out as fast as i can i did receive it today um and it's a very big box and so let's go ahead and get started. I'm sorry I'm talking a lot. I'm trying to get it done fast because <laughs> it's been a day and my husband's almost home. He'll be home in a couple of hours and I just want to get this done and up and for you guys to see. So if you haven't seen my last video, my last video was my Ipsy. Um, you should watch that one. That was very, very interesting. So anyways, for those people, for the ones that have already watched my Ipsy before this one for the month of March, um, I did contact Ipsy and let them know about their mistake. So they have offered and to replace the whole entire bag um, because it was a wrong variation. And they said that I can go ahead and keep the items that they sent me um, so that I wouldn't have to go through the trouble of having to return it and send get another box and send it out. So that's a good sign. So let's go ahead and get into this box. This is a big box. This is a different box. So only so many people receive this white box with the green. And if you receive this box, you were entered into a drawing. And in that drawing, oh, I hate the I, Hold on. I have a really bad problem with card bo cardboard boxes, but it's, and it makes my teeth and it makes me, I don't know, there's people out there that would understand what I'm talking about and I also have a problem with the salt, like um, the salt, with, like it comes in the big cardboard thing and you Ugh. I don't know how to get rid of it it just and I feel like it's getting worse over time and it's if really bothering me so anyways let's go ahead and get started it was packaged like I said but this is the second time that I'm having to film this again so this month's um, theme is lucky so this is the card and then on the other side it gives us the um, everything that's on the in the box as well as its retail price and so in the corner here we have the variation and the variation is for March 21 this is the variation 401 so the first item in the box is going to be this eyeshadow palette this is by Barbarella so 
I've never heard of this brand by B Beauty London. That's the name of it. Um, in the back, it says Jet Milled Color. It says delivers intense saturated color. It's light reflective sheens with velvety finish, gorgeous golds, pretty pearls, and frosted greens. So here is the front of the palette. It is a little bit raised, the letters raised. So we have purple lashes, we have the Barbarella and the white. We also have this honeycomb with the black. Now when I opened this, I was very disappointed. I was disappointed on the color story. So let me go ahead and show you before I start rambling. So this is the color story. It has a lot of neutral colors. There's only one pop of color except the green. This is a matte. There's only five matte shades in here and the rest are shimmers. These shimmers are very, um, they look pretty on the, like on the, on the swatch on my finger. But as you apply them, which my swatches are already erased, they're very, very sheer. And, um, like, they're very similar. So, we have very similar shades in here. Um, I'm overwhelmed with the amount of neutrals that are in this palette. I do like neutrals. I did go do color today because I hadn't done color in a while. So, my last, um, eyeshadow looks have been very... Um, colorful I've been very inspired by this one eyeshadow palette and let me go ahead and show you this is what I expect inside a, a eyeshadow palette and this did not meet my expectations for one the color story on the outside does not match the color story on the inside um, and that's a $50 eyeshadow palette no so this is the one that I have been very inspired by this is the Tiny Marvels palette um, with Mel Thompson, and this is a Sydney Grace eyeshadow palette. This eyeshadow palette is what I love. I also love neutrals, but this eyeshadow palette right here has really inspired me, and it it inspired me to start creating again on my eyes. That's one thing that I love. I love to be artistic on my eyes. I'm a very artistic person. Um, like when I draw and when I color, I'm not like the most perfect <laughs> illustrator or how do you say it, but I love to create and I create on my eyes, I create on my face. And so let me show you this eyeshadow palette. This eyeshadow palette is everything. <laughs> now, when I talk about shame, like sh color, like, um, let me go ahead and swatch this one. This one is a duochrome. This one is like a beetle. So you would describe a beetle let me see if you can see it so it has I don't know if I can't see it right here but these shifts on this particular eyeshadow it's absolutely beautiful so and then we have this really pretty yellow one I think I did this one like a couple days ago. You can find it on my Instagram. Like the eyeshadows are very intense. Um, the one I have on my eyes today is this really pretty green. And I also have this purple right here which is Jewel B. And then I also have these two in here as well. So. This is what I expect in the eyeshadow palette. It tells you the story on the outside. And it tells you the story on the inside. You know, we have purples, the purples, we have greens, we have pinks. And this is what I mean by color stories. So, I don't know. I'm just very overwhelmed by this eyeshadow palette. I expected more. But, especially for $50. You know, I mean, if someone was to pay $50... And to receive that palette and that would be horrible I would be so disappointed so anyways let's move on we spent about 10 minutes talking about this eyeshadow palette that I'm not interested in <laughs> okay 
So this is the B Beauty London Barbarella eyeshadow palette. It says meet the black book of color with subtle shades to straight up blast of color. Jet milled pigments deliver intense saturated light reflective shades with gorgeous textures plus long lasting and non-creasing silky and velvety finishes. This retails for $50. And honestly, I feel like a lot of people, because I've, like I said, I've received this late, so I've seen many of unboxings of this boxy box, and a lot of people have been upset about how it says in here that it's colorful, that it has, you know, blasts of colors. Honestly, I don't think that this is the company's fault. I honestly think it's BoxyCharm's fault because BoxyCharm misled their consumers on saying that it was going to be packed, you know, um, with, with, it's a meet the black book of color with subtle shades to straight up blast of color. Now that, I don't think that that's on the company for B Beauty, honestly. It is the description that is made in here that is a disappointment to us consumers from BoxyCharm. So, can, should I be mad at this company? I am kind of upset with the color story on the outside. But on the back, it does say right here, it says... Jet milled color delivers intense saturated colors, light reflective sheens with velvety finish. It's gorgeous golds, pretty pearls, and frosted greens. So who has who's at fault here? BoxyCharm is because BoxyCharm printed these cards. So for those of you that you know are out there that have described it as, oh well, it's the eyeshadow palettes, you know, brand that it's their fault. It's not their fault. So the next thing in this um, box is going to be this item. I did choose this item. This is by G by Gennaro Makeup Holder. So this is a brush holder. Um, it retails for $34. Apparently that's what it says here. Um, and when you open it, I like that you can reuse this box. So it has the box, it has a magnet on it. Go ahead and move that. So this is the um, eyeshadow brush holder, well brush holder. Um, this is the thinness of it. It's not very luxe. For $34, I did expect it to be much thicker, much heavier, a little bit more um, durable. You know what I mean? I feel like if I were to drop this, it would break. And it, sorry about the loud noise. I don't feel like this is very luxe, especially for $34 for a consumer. I mean, I think that that's not fair, but um, I can't complain because I didn't pay $34 for it. Um, so it came with these little tabs so that you can put at the bottom of this. So I guess it has the grip on it. It says face, eyes, and lips. So I'm excited to go ahead and put my brushes in there so I can save some room on my little vanity here. So let's go ahead and read about that. That is the G by Gennaro Brush Crush Makeup Brush Holder. It's a stylish way to store your makeup brushes. This holder has three compartments to keep your vanity clean, drawers uncluttered, and brushes organized. So it's always easy to find the one you need. And it retails for $34. So there's that. The next thing in my box is by the KVD. It used to be Kat Von D. Well, actually, this is marketed as Kat Von D, um, which is surprising because KVD, Kat Von D, this um, brand was actually bought out by another lady. And now they, it's called KVD instead of Kat Von D, which everybody knows Kat Von D, KVD. They should have rebranded the whole thing and kept the aesthetic but rebranded the name on it honestly because when you think about KVD everybody thinks about Kat Von D automatically so this did have a plastic on it I did take it off this is a foundation brush this is in the number 10 I love it because I don't have many brushes I'm trying to grow out my collection and because I have more eyeshadow brushes than I do face brushes so I'm excited to receive this um, I do like how this is very luxe to me and it's heavy it's not thin it's not it doesn't feel cheap it feels very luxe and it's beautiful I love how it tapers off to go thin um, the brushes um, it does I don't know if you're gonna be able to tell but it actually slims in from the base it slims in and of course um, well I guess you can see it how it slims in through here and then it kind of has like a curvature 
I don't know if it's going to show it. But I'm actually very excited to have this brush. I'm going to go ahead and read about it. This is the KVD Vegan Beauty Lock It Edge Foundation Brush Number 10. This high-performance foundation brush features an original custom design with a sculpted shape that conforms to the curves and contours of your face. The perfectly symmetrical tapered bristles allow you to reach every corner from every angle for precise, even blending. And it retails for $34. I do... I can say that this brush retails for $34. It feels like a $34 price tag because like I said it's not plasticky it doesn't feel cheap it's very luxe in my opinion the just the weight in it the barrel of the brush um especially how this it's not raised but I mean this is what luxe to me is I'm excited to try it um to actually get into the curves of your face I think this would be awesome as well to contour um, so I'm excited to have this brush. Let's move on to the next product. Okay, so I'm not excited about this product. I've seen unboxings and I've seen people review it and altogether I'm not excited. And as well, I don't like glitter. I'm not a glitter person, especially when it comes to arts and crafts, like glitter all over my floor. Oh my gosh, that is a nightmare for me. Like, and, and I hate to have glitter all over my body, all over my face. I love shimmers when it's like finely, finely milled. But as far as glitter, I'm not a fan. Not a fan at all. I can't stand it. So this is the 24 karat gold lip plumbing mask. It says Kiss the Stars. This is by Amina. I'm going to assume that's what it says. Because it's A-M-N-H skincare. And to me, I, I'm reading it as Amina. I don't know if you can see it. And it's this glitter, gold glittery, chunky stars formula to put on my lips. Nope. This is what it looks like. This is what the product looks like. It's not even sealed. So I'm not thrilled about that. It's, it smells like toothpaste. It smells like toothpaste. Yeah, that ain't going on my lips. I wouldn't even test this on my hand because I will not be keeping this product at all. It says, it's 24 karat gold shimmer, aloe vera gel, jojoba oil, aloe vera juice, vitamin E, vegan collagen, peppermint flavor, oil, golden biodegradable glitter stars. It says apply on even amount of mass to makeup free lips. Leave on for three to five minutes. Wash off lips with water. A tingling sensation is normal. It means it's working. No. I feel like that glitter would suck out the moisture from my skin. And my lips are already dry, so I try to moisturize them as much as I can. So I'm not a fan. Anyways, this is the Amina Skincare Kiss the Scars. Kiss, kiss the Scars. Kiss the Stars 24 Gold Lip Plumping Mask. This is 24 Gold and Biodegradable Glitter Stars Lip Plumping Mask. Will moisturize and nourish your lips. Expect a tingling sensation, sensation and softer kissable lips. It retails for $42. There's no way. I would ever pay $42 for that. I probably can make my own lip mask cheaper than that. No. Um, I'm not excited that this came in my box. I think that this is a filler and I don't think that it's worth $42 at all. It's like they switched the 24 karat to 42. I honestly think that's like maybe a $10 product if not $8 product. Mm, I don't, not happy about that one. So, the next product in my box is the Dominique Cosmetics. It's by Dominique Cosmetics. This is a lip liner. It's a creamy fill and define lip liner. It says define and fill your lips with this unique teardrop shaped lip liner. It's narrow at the tip for precise and wider and wider at the bottom to fill. It's infused with clean Good for you ingredients like vitamin E to protect from free radicals, boost circulation, smooth fine lines, and keep lips pillowy soft. The silky long-lasting demi-matte demi, demi finish is so light and breathable you'll forget you're wearing it. So 
this is what this looks like it actually looks like a teardrop you can't see it actually looks like a teardrop i kind of already swatched it i'm gonna go ahead and test this out for you let me look at my mirror and this is in the shade crush I feel like this is like an ASMR moment. Okay. My thoughts. The formula is very, very creamy. It's pigmented. It's very, um, I already had swatched it earlier. It's very creamy. It's a neutral color. I like that. I enjoy receiving lip liners because I can use them. I actually will use this. So I'm excited to receive that, especially by Dominique Cosmetics. She's, it's a really good brand. I received a lip gloss in the past two years. I did, and this, it's already like all ugly because it's very old. But the formula in this one, it's, um, it's by the, this was the sweet peach. No, it's the peach tea lip gloss. They also had a lemonade lip gloss by the same, it's the same one like this, but it was more pinker. The formula is amazing on these. It's really, really good. It's not sticky. It's like very soft um, and smooth and buttery and very, very moisturizing. Like if you're looking for a lip product from Dominique Cosmetics, I highly recommend that. And I think that retails for $24. And if you ask me, that is an extraordinary price for that product because it's so good. And that's a product that you're going to use constantly. And it's not going to be a disappointment. So this is the Dominique Cosmetics Creamy Fill and Define Liner. Did I reread it? Yes, I did. I think I read it, right? I read it. Yes, I did. I'm sorry. It happened to me the last video as well. I did the same thing. I couldn't remember if I read a product. This product I'm upset about. I was very excited to receive it. Because this was one of my choice items. My choice item was the brush holder and this product. And yeah. Not my shade. Not my shade at all. This is for a deeper complexion. And the fact that they sent me a very dark shade. Like. It's very disappointing because... On the choice, you're able to choose a um, shade. And my shade was in the shade like 170. And this was going to be the first time that I tried this product. And I was very excited because it's by Rihanna. And this is in the shade 380. Like we're way, way off. So I did contact BoxyCharm and I left them an email telling them that they sent me the wrong shade. So hopefully they can send me a replacement for it. So that is the K, uh, the Fenty Beauty. That's by Rihanna. This is a Fenty P Beauty Pro Filter Soft Matte, matte Longwear Foundation. This long-wearing light-as-air foundation gives skin an instantly smooth, pore-diffuse, shine-free finish. The oil-free formula is made with climate-adaptive technology that resists to sweat and humidity and won't clog pores so that whatever wherever you are, it's going to work on your skin. It retails for $36. And I have combination skin. So my T-zone is more oily and the rest of my face is kind of normal to dry skin. So the fact that I was receiving a high-end foundation and that would more than likely work with my skin, uh, I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed because I was excited about that product. So there's that. The next product in here, everybody received this one. And I'm excited because I have not tried anything from Glow Recipe. So this is the box. Sorry. Cardboard is bothering me. <laughs> this is the Glow Recipe Plump Plump 
uh, hyaluronic serum. I need that away from me because... So this is what this looks like. It's beautiful. I love the packaging. It is glass. It does come with a pump. Um, it's clear. I think this is going to work amazing. Especially hyaluronic acid. It's really, really good for your skin. It helps to plump your skin. It helps to moisturize and retain the moisture in your skin. So... It smells very good. It smells clean. Um, I don't. It doesn't smell like plum. So, anyways, this is the Glow Recipe Plum Plump Hyaluronic Serum. This concentrated formula is your go-to serum for plump, radiant skin. The Silky Water Gel Serum features a unique blend of three types of plum, hyaluronic acid, and vegan collagen. The formula contains five weights of hyaluronic acid to target different layers of the skin for deep hydration, and it retails for forty-two dollars. Now, Glow Recipe is a really good brand. It is very well known in the beauty industry, and I'm excited to try it. I've never received anything from Glow Recipe, and it, BoxyCharm has a history of with uh, sending products of Glow Recipe, and as well as Pharmacy. I love Pharmacy. I was introduced by Pharmacy from BoxyCharm, and I am grateful because I love their products. It's really, really good. It's clean beauty. There's nothing that's going to harm your skin. It's very very clean I love it so this is this I'm very excited to receive this product um, I'm gonna go ahead and read from the back because now I feel misled by reading that box I mean reading the the card because like I said what happened with the Barbarella eyeshadow palette for example so this is the deep hydration and glow this concentrated formula is your go-to serum for plump radiant scent skin this silky water gel serum features a unique blend of three types of plum which include vitamin c rich kakadu plum that helps boost skin for a youthful appearance with hyaluronic acid and vegan collagen and delivers protective antioxidants for deep hydration the formula contains five weights of hyaluronic acid ultra low low medium high ultra high to target different layers of the skin with added firming vegan plant collagen and silk protein Skin is hydrated instantly and throughout the day. It says usage. Before moisturizer, dispense one to two pumps and gently pat on lightly damp face and neck until fully absorbed. Apply daily and a.m. and p.m. So, like I said, this retails for $42. I'm excited to have this. This is something that I'm going to keep. Something that I'm very excited about. The next and final product is the Rose Quartz Hair Mask. This is um, zero sulfate, sodium, chloride. Like this is everything that it's free of. So it's free of sul sulfates, sodium chloride, PEGs, parabens, phthalates, dyes, mineral oil. It's safe for all chemically treated hair extensions, wigs. It has a 24 month span. It, you can even refill it. Um, it's animal, it's cruelty free. Um, this says, hair mask loves deeply, transcend dry damage and breakage to experience soft, silky shine, refresh and rejuvenate your hair, mind, hair and spirit with daily to weekly treatments while meditating in aromas of rose water and sweet violet. It says directions generously apply half, like a uh, half from root to tips and massage gently by mindful of your be mindful of your solitude finger comb then clip up away from the water breathe deeply repeat loving affirmations for two to five minutes i'm awesome i deserve self-care on bad days cry it out rinse mask off but not out with cold water find beauty in your day and share your best and i think that's awesome that it has affirmations like that you know to tell yourself you know that you're worthy you're valuable you're important you're loved I think that's awesome and I'm excited to try this. This is what this looks like. It's a very whipped formula. It kind of feels like, um, oh, that feels awesome. The texture is, oh, that feels awesome. It doesn't feel like heavy, like a coconut oil, like how coconut oil tends to be very, it's meltable but it feels thick it feels heavy this doesn't feel like that um i also there's a, a lady that i watch on youtube i can't even think of her name 
It's Makeup Diva. Oh, I can't even remember her name. I'll see if I can link it down in my description. But she talks about this and she raves about it. She has the same problem. We've had thyroid problems and I've had thyroid problems for years. And my hair is very, very brittle. I don't know if you can see, but my hair is very, very dry as well as brittle. So she raves about this. And you can also purchase this in Boxy Charms pop-up or add-ons. And they sell it at discount prices. This is a $31 product. And you can find it in their store for like 4 to $6. And I actually picked up another one because it's she raves about it so much and I think if it can help her hair with a thyroid problem I think it's gonna be amazing for my hair as you can tell I have flyaways because my hair is not healthy it doesn't have no hydration in it and it's very dehydrated and the fact that you know she is a she tested this product and she's loved it for so long already I think she's used it for months now and you can see the difference in our hair and I'm so excited to try this on my hair honestly. So this is the Rose Quartz Hair Mask. It says your touchstone of hair products, the Rose Quartz Hair Mask suits a spectrum of needs with zero sul sulfates and I already told you all this. And it's vegan and certified cruelty free made with love in the USA. It retails for $31. I'm excited. I'm excited about this product. So. The only two products that I'm very disappointed in is this gold one as well as my foundation. So overall, I do think that it is worth the price. Um, so I'm excited about this box, but also a little bit disappointed. Hopefully they can fix the problem. Um, I, I love Ipsy as well because Ipsy actually, they actually listen to their consumers and their customers. And their customer service is amazing you know for them for you to message them with a problem that you're having and for them to respond so fast and fix the problem is amazing to me and i'm really hoping that i'm going to have the same experience with boxycharm because i am a creator on youtube you know i create videos for you guys so that i can test products and i can unbox subscription boxes with you guys so that i can show you what's the possibility of what you can receive and you know how I feel about products like this and is it worth it so please leave down your comments down below your thoughts what did you think about the box do you like the box did you receive any products as well like me are we box twins is there anything that you've tried that you don't agree with um leave that down below don't forget to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit the like button I am doing in the middle of a declutter video so I already did my primers next is my foundations and concealers and we'll move on to my powders I need to do that one so I think I'm gonna do that tomorrow I might have time I do have to do a very big chore I have already swept them off my house and cleaned it the only thing that I really have to do is do my room and my clothes like all the clothes in the house I've already washed them I just need to hang them and fold them and it's so much and it's overwhelming <laughs> that it's like I want to stay away from it but anyways we're already going on 34 minutes I'm thankful for you guys that you have stayed around um, watching this video um, I'm gonna be having a giveaway for you guys I was gonna wait until after my declutter to go ahead and do that giveaway so stay tuned because it's a really good one. Um, I don't know if I'm going to add any more products. But it is one main product. And it's an expensive product. This product retails for $89. It's by a well known. Um, it's a well known brand. And I bought two of them. And I specifically bought another one. And I'm going to go ahead and gift it to you guys. But you have got to be subscribed to my channel. You have to watch my videos. And leave comments down in my videos so I know that you're a true supporter and you're actually following my videos you're not just here passing by and saying oh well I want it for my people that support me that are here with me that are gonna grow on this journey with me um, because I want to get back to you guys so I have not hit a thousand subscribers yet I know that most of my viewers are not subscribed to my channel. I can see it on the analytics on my YouTube studio. Um, so like I said, in order to be entered to that giveaway, you have got to be subscribed to my channel. And you have to watch my videos and you have to follow me on Instagram. I will leave my information down in the description box how to go to my Instagram and click on there and follow me. Um, if you don't have Instagram, I totally understand. I will be checking to see if you're subscribed to my channel 
as well as following me on my Instagram. And if not, if you don't have Instagram, I totally understand. You know, there's older people that do not have Instagram, do not know what that is. But like I said, just go ahead and leave a comment down below. Let me know how your day is going. Baby's up already. I was trying to avoid that. But I love you guys and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye, you guys. Thank you.